Hi, this is Greg with Engaging Teacher. I'm starting a new TPT store and guiding me through the process will be Rebecca. She started her TPT store over five years ago and has agreed to answer my questions and share her experiences running an online business. All right, so you've walked me through all the information I'm going to need. So let's go ahead and actually upload some products. Um, I'd like to do a free resource first and then a paid resource after that. Okay. And TPT does require that you have that free resource, so I'm glad that you've got that ready to go. The first thing that we've got in here is we have our title and we have our description already done. And we did those in a document offline, so or we did it in a Google Doc, I think, but you could also do it in Word or whatever. Mm -hmm. And we do that in order to make sure that we have the document because there's nothing more frustrating than starting to type in your description and it's perfect and everything you want and then the site goes down mm, or your computer yep. goes down so yes definitely want to make sure that you have that also it's easy to edit okay and then you can use it over and over exactly all right okay um now now that we have the title the description ready for the product let's do it okay so this is going to be selecting it from your Google Drive. And let's choose your Google Drive. Hey, Teachers Pay Teachers wants access to your Google account. And it tells you which one. This is going to allow them to view and manage metadata of files in your drive. And if you want more information here, you can get that. Metadata includes information such as the file's tita, title, description, and modified date. Okay. Information about the files, but not about their contents. Okay. All right. View and manage Google Drive files and folders that you have opened or created with this app. So we can read through all of this. I'm not going to read it out loud to you, but in order to make sure that you're comfortable. Okay. All right, it says, make sure you trust Teachers Pay Teachers. You can go through and read their terms of service, their privacy policies, and that you can always undo it. Okay. Okay, and then about you can learn about the risks right here. All right. But in order for this to work, you have to allow them to do it. All right, All so right. I'm going to allow. Okay. All right, so here's your folders. It's in here and then here and then the file you want is right here so this is the one google slide that you want okay and it looks like it's in there and preview we've got that saved let me come over here and find it just a moment please this is module one, lesson one? Yes. All right. And we're uploading that. All right. And the main cover, we'll find that as well. All right. So we have the actual product in there. We have the PDF which that will be a preview. So it's the exact same product, but we put preview across the screen and they can't change that. Yeah. And then, so what we did for, to make these was we went into the file and we just saved each slide as a JPEG. Okay. So the first one, the main cover, we've already got in there, but now I was curious if Google would, if the Google Drive would select these thumbnails. Because it did that for your And I'm wondering, it doesn't look like it's updated here. So I'm wondering if it's still uploading. I see. I, I mean, I don't know. But since we're in here, we can go ahead and select. So now let's choose three pictures that you like, that you think are a good indicator for the potential buyer for mm -hmm. what's included. Probably like the hands. Okay. And then one of the detectives. Well, let's see, that's a concept development. 
What about an application problem? Oh, there you go. Yeah, because it's giving it... Kind of an order. Right. Okay. All right. So now those are all uploading. Oh, no, it looks like that is because, look, it says last updated. It's not doing this. So okay. apparently Google doesn't pull previews for you okay. for thumbnails. All right, so that's different. Okay. Um, this is your free? Yes. Okay, and this is a first grade product? Yes. And this is a math product? Yes. Are there any other... Um, I don't think so. No. All right, and your resource type, we said this was a Google? Mm-hmm. Google mm -hmm. app. And then a lecture. It's a lecture, okay. And, and lesson plan individual. All right. And we don't have any custom categories yet. That might happen in the future, but for right now, you don't have them. Okay. All right, your common core state standards. We are in first grade. We have two of them. Two of them, all right. And... You can see here, it's got the mathematical practice, which is nice, so you can choose that in mm -hmm. there. Um, measurement and data. It also has numbers um, and operations in base 10, and then operations in algebraic thinking. And that's what we have for this one. Mm -hmm. So it's that first one, 1.0a.a1, a1, and then 1.0a.5. Five. All right. So we'll click done, and see, it's just that easy to add them in there. All right, do you want to put a teaching duration or number of slides or any of that? No. Okay. All right, and we'll select this because we've got some other things in there. Let's create it. Let's see what happens. I wonder if these will ever show. Like, it just said it was last updated, but you couldn't see pictures in here. I wonder if that's just from computer speed or... Maybe. Maybe. Because look, these aren't even in here yet. Yep. So I bet. Now let's look at our preview. All right. So we have the whole product in here and just put preview on every screen. Yep. And let's look at our description. All of the links are in there. There's a standards tab there too which adds the standards in the description. Nice. Okay, that's where you see them. And it tells you to, made for Google Drive, tells the buyer right here to access it. You're gonna have to agree to giving them access. All right. All right, so because you're the owner, it doesn't say download, it'll say edit. Mm. Okay. okay. All right, so it looks like now it just needs its processing time. All right, You've great. You've got your first free product. All right. Congratulations. Thank you.